Hi everyone, I am Natalia Mota. I'm here at Broward Spirit Society. Today I talk a little bit in Portuguese about um, things that take time. Because right now, on the time that we are living, we are kind of forgetting that real things take time to get done or to be finished. Like, for example, our family. We don't have a construction of our family in a short time. We don't do this very quickly. So we need time to put our family in the right place, to uh, construct our home. We need time to do the things that is really, really important to us. So everything that is happening right now, it's kind of uh, letting us forgetting that we should take this time and enjoy this time to do things that we are always giving excuses that we have no time to do. Like spending time with people that we care, like our family, that live together with us, that live at the same house. Uh, spend time is maybe using technology to contact that, that people, that person that we love and we cannot be in person with them because maybe they are uh, in risk because they are older or they have any health issues and they need to protect themselves more than other people. So what I talk today, uh, what is my suggestion to you guys today is that, for example, in Genesis, the book Genesis, Miracles and Predictions According to Spiritism, Kardec and the Spiritists, they bring it to us, the God, it's pure, wise, just and good. So if a God it's all those things and pure, how can we think that all these things, all the bad things that is happening in the world right now, it's because God allowed us to happen? No, us as human beings, we are that we have this expression, right? That we create our own demons. Please don't take me wrong. I'm not saying this in the bad way. I'm saying that unfortunately, a lot of things that we pass through in our life, bad things, difficult times, is because in certain way, we, the human beings, we created that. But also in the Genesis, uh, Kardec and the spirits bring it to us that God gave us the intelligence to pass through these situations and get over all the bad things in the world if we can think, if we can use that intelligence. Let's follow that intelligence and try to create something that it's good for us right now. Let's watch a movie with the people that we love. Let's read a book, everybody together. Let's do something that is enjoyable and that we always have the excuses. Oh, if I have more time, I could do this. If I have more time, I could do that. Like, for example, organizing your home, organizing this temple, this material temple that you live on. Organize your room, your closet. Let's take this time extra that we are having to do these small things, but that it is important. Let's put it uh, some effort to be more close to the persons that the person that it is with you right now, your family, your husband, your wife, your children. And also let's use the technology in favor of us right now and do good things. Do you imagine if this situation right that happened right now happened in the 80s? Like not everybody could have a computer at the house. The internet's not like it is right now. We did not have smartphones. So what we should do if those type of things, the stay home situation happen there. So let's try to use the things that we have in our hands right now to help other people the way that we can. A lot of websites, a lot of uh, institutions, they are giving free classes online. They are giving uh, free um, information online, workouts and lessons and books and audiobooks. So let's try to use these. Let's read a book together, everyone. Even though if it's an audiobook, everybody can listen to this book and talk about it. It's a good way that you can also use the internet. You can use a FaceTime to talk with your friends. If you guys need help, if you guys want to contact us with any information, with any question that you guys need, please contact us and try as much as you can 
meditate or pray. If you don't know how to meditate, you can start praying. With a prayer, you can elevate your, vib your uh, vibration, you can elevate your thoughts, and if you're feeling that you are having this panic attack, that you are freaking out with all the information that you're seeing, please, the best solution is always praying. So thank you everybody for watching, and I see you guys maybe in the next video. Thank you, peace.